the stem cells that I'm talking about right now are the stem cells that are already present in our muscles. So we all have stem cells in our muscles. So if you damage your muscle, the stem cells actually regenerate and make new muscle. Okay. So they can be from an adult. They, they, are, in, they are actually already inside you. So we're not, they, they're there from birth till you're for your whole life. And so these stem cells that are present in our muscles uh, can be used to regenerate and make new muscle in individuals who have muscle atrophies or muscular dystrophies. Okay? Now, it's a very early stage right now. We don't fully understand how these stem cells actually replace muscle. So we have four to five grants in the current cycle that are designed to specifically address how these stem cells can actually regenerate muscle. I'll tell you what the importance of this is. So for most of the therapies that are currently being designed for Duchenne muscular dystrophy or spinal muscular atrophy, they are designed to slow or stop the degeneration of muscle. They don't actually make new muscle. Okay? So if you have a child who's lost a certain amount of muscle uh, you know, mass, uh, giving the therapy at that stage will prevent further loss, but will not actually make more muscle come back to come back to the normal state. So the stem cell research that we are putting money into right now, hopefully over the next several years, will actually help us not only stop the disease, but actually regain some of the muscle that's lost to come back to the normal state.